Hey, hi, I'm Mona. This is Sacred Geometry Universe Video Journal Diary for January 26th, 2024. Yeah, sweater's still looking okay. I'm using it like as a sweatshirt, like as an over, you know? I don't know, I don't know, you know what? I don't know about washing this. And it doesn't really say anything on the tag. <laughs> it didn't cost that much, so hopefully I don't ruin it. Because I think I'm going to have to do some laundry. Maybe tomorrow or the next day. So it's Friday. So anyways, what happened today? Like today, I, w I ended up like... <sighs> I, was, I was thinking, because I went to the VA yesterday, right? And then I was thinking, all right, I'm going to get up tomorrow and I'm going to go in. I'm going to go into the emergency. It was nothing like I thought, though. It wasn't uh, like emergency. They basically, it's like they're not working in there anymore. Like no one's working in the offices anymore. Like who, like who gets their care at the VA? Like if it's an emergency, there is no emergencies, not for dental. So anyways, I mean, I had a casual visit though, you know, like I didn't have any stress when I was there. I, I had a little bit because I saw how my blood pressure looked because, you know, I, I'm in tune with my body. So I saw what the blood pressure was, and I know that's not from going to the dentist. That's from just being in the VA. Um, because, you know, the VA, they trigger my PTSD, you know, so I don't I don't like to be there. Um, <clears throat> so anyways, I go and I wait and I wait and I wait again and I... And then I go in and then they did an x-ray and then I wait again and then I wait again and then I go in and only to find out that they're not even going to do any work. They're just going to tell me and outsource me somewhere out in town, which is fine. But it's like, what happened to the VA? Who's working there now? It's only people who are just like looking at you and then they'll outsource you out to out in town. Like that's... That's weird because when I went to Long Beach VA, they took me right then and there. I signed up, signed in, and they took me right then and there. They took care of the problem right away. Over here, I still have to wait two to four weeks just for them to, uh, I need the tooth pulled for them to pull out the tooth, tooth and then they're going to give me a prosthetic. But if it's if I'm in pain, how come they're not doing it emergency? Because I have a little pain and I told them about that. So this is a terrible thing. The VA is sucks. The VA hospital, dental, whatever, they suck, you know. Um but you know, it didn't get it didn't get done and I ha and you know, I'm going to have to float around here for the next couple months because of them now. Well, I was going to anyways, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't know where I was going to be floating around at, though. So at least I know now I'm just going to float around over here. We're, we're near Austin. So I have to kind of stay around Austin area for, like, uh, the next couple months until they get this work done. Um, but it's okay. You know, I kind of, this is, the area I'm in right now, I really like it. I wish I could stay here longer. Somebody told me a little sneaky way because I met, I met uh, two guys up here and uh, they're really cool too. I really, really like them. I was so disappointed in myself because since I've been here, I've seen them here and I just met them today and I'm leaving on Monday. So it's like, darn, that's what sucks when you meet like some cool people and you're like, darn, I wish I could have met them when I first got here. You know, it's okay. It's okay. Um, anyways. So I was chit-chatting with them, you know, and they have a pooch, but we, I kept, you know, the, the doggies were separate, but it was really nice to talk to them. I like had, it was good conversation, you know, um, anyhow, they told me about a trick about being around here. And so, but I, I already, I already reserved uh, a spot uh, from here. So I'm going to go there next. I'm going to try to utilize the 14 days there and just hang out, you know, and, I don't have anything extra special planned, so I figure I just uh, if the if the um, data is good, I'm just gonna start putting out some readings and stuff, you know. 
Uh, and, you know, we go for walks and stuff, but I, I really don't want to drive. I really don't want to go into town or because then I'll be spending money and I don't want to spend money because I don't need to spend money. You know what I'm saying? Like I have all my foods. The weather is cold enough that I barely don't have to go and get ice. Uh, my tank is like three quarters of a way full, even coming, going to the VA and coming back. So it's like, you know, I don't want to go out in town. And plus, it's a little stressful for me out there because it's uh, going to be the, it's Friday and the weekend is here. And that's when, you know, everybody's or a lot of people are off work and it's like a zoo out there. I, I really don't want to, <laughs> you know, but there's a lot of nice walking area around here. Um, I have already made a video of one spot. We didn't even walk the whole thing because it was really long, you know, but there's a good spot to walk over there. And then there's another area around here by the lake because I'm by a lake. And so there's another nice area here. There's also another place to camp across. And I tried to reserve there, but they're counting it as these being together. So I have to move completely out of the area to the next which is fine which is fine because we can go to the next area and experience what's over there and then go to another area because you know it's some couple days you have to uh it's like 30 they said the the people i spoke to back there it's like they said it's like 32 days before you can come back you know um, but there's these all over, so, you know, I'll be able to stay at, um, I'm actually, I'm staying at recreation.gov, you know, and they're all over, you know, they're like an hour away, two hour away, 30 minute away. So I'll just jump around until I get the work done. Cause you know, and I don't mind that. I don't have nothing planned. Um, I haven't been doing the tarot much. I'm going to maybe start doing a little more tarot cause it's fun. It takes time and I like listening and you know, and stuff like that. Um, I'm going to start doing some pick a cards. Those are fun. I like to do those. Uh, and aside from re Oh, another thing I've been doing, cause you know, I'm making hats, 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 hats. And I'm thinking like, gosh, I'm kind of tired of making hats right now. <laughs> so I kind of, I made, uh, I've been making earrings. I have so many beads and stuff. You guys, I need to do something with them. I just don't know who I'm going to give all these to. Like, here's one set. See, it has little... See how I made them? It has little feathers on the bottom. I have, like... How many is here? One, two, three, four, five, six different pairs of earrings that I made. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. I don't know... They're all different, though. And they all have different stones. I don't know. Maybe if I run into somebody or some ladies, I will. I don't know. That's a different thing than like giving like, oh, I have a hat for you. It's, it's different. Like earrings. Like I don't know. I don't know what I'm gonna do with those. Honestly, I'm just gonna just keep doing it, and then we'll see what happens. You know. Um, but uh, oh, I just had a good idea, and it's something that keeps me busy. I just have to get some hemp rope. That's the next project. <laughs> That's the next project. But for right now, you know, as for the creativity stuff, you know, I'm just draw, doing some little drawings and making little earrings. Right now, I just got done cleaning this place uh, because the, ta the tables were starting to get filled. And, you know, I, I did organize that, but it's already a mess again, you know, because I went to the store and I had to get some 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 needed items. I don't I didn't buy I am still on that kick. I'm not buying things that are, you know, no more gift buying gifties and you know and or anything like that because I was buying gifts and giving them away to people too. So I'm not doing that anymore because I, you know, I don't need to and I, you know, I I did I did have this and I've been looking for this for a long time. You see this it's like a little uh hand carved luck charm i'm gonna give this to those guys that i met you know i gave i bought two and i gave one to uh these one girls that i met and so now i'm gonna give this one to those guys you know and then i'm i gotta really stop you know uh doing that you know because i kind of i kind of have an idea and i mean i don't know if exactly i'm gonna do it because i'm nervous but i i do I do believe that oh, saving money is always a good idea, right? 
But um, just for right now, <laughs> I'm a little excited about the future, but I'm nervous at the same time. So I'm not, I'm not 100% sure that I'm going to do what's on my mind because I'm just not, I'm not, I don't know if I'm ready yet. So, but I don't want to talk about it because, you know, it's, it's not very good to talk about future plans too much. I used to do that. And, and then I realized it's not a good idea because you might have people out there trying to sabotage your ideas, you know? It's not good. It was better keep it quiet, keep it silent, you know? Um, anyways, you know, nobody should really care. If they care, then they're weirdos. <laughs> you know, if they care about what you got going on in your life and your future and this that, and the other, you're dealing with a bunch of weirdos. And I suggest you get away <laughs> if you can. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's all I have. So we're going to float around the area here in Texas where I'm at, around Austin. And, um, that's it, really. That's it. Um, all I've been doing is just chilling, really, you know? Um, I'm glad I went to the dentist today, though, because you see how long it's going to take them to get back to me. I should have done it right when I got here, but I didn't think about it. So, you know, we're just going to see what happens, and I'll keep you all posted. It's not really a big deal anyway. It's just I just need a tooth pulled now. That's it. They're going to pull out a tooth, and then I'm going to get a prosthetic to replace it so it's not an empty space, and that's it, you know. So <laughs> it's really not a big deal, you know. I was really hoping to go there and then have it yanked out right now, but, you know, they don't do nothing over there, which is that is so strange to me. The VA is really going downhill. It's been it's been, there is no good health care for anybody. No, no veterans right now. There is none. It's just people getting paid in that building. They don't really care about us. You know, they just, they're getting their paycheck. That's what they're getting. Anyways, that's all I have. <laughs> that's all I have. Um, and uh, we're just chilling here at the same spot. We're leaving this spot on Monday, though, and going to a different spot for 14 days. And I'm just, we're just going to hop around here because I'm going to be getting some dental work done. And that's about it. Um, but I'm Mona. This was January 26, 2024. And this is Sacred Geometry Universe Video Journal Diary. And I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.